I've been working in the area of land and land conservation for my entire career. And there's always been an aspect of culture in the way I look at land. And so most recently, my research has begun to focus on that essential connection between culture and land and how different cultures look at the land and how they relate to the land. And what that means is whether or not we're willing to take the difficult steps to conserve land and to protect the resources that are on the land. A lot of my work deals with heritage and heritage in society and heritage as a part of culture. So looking at the land means I look at the way that people live on the land. Being in the Department of Landscape Architecture and Regional Planning as a landscape architect and a lawyer, I look at the land and those essential connections as an aspect of sustainability. When I look at cultures and heritage, I look at the way they live on the land, how they create their communities, and how those communities are integrated with the natural ecosystems. As we get into the decades of climate change that are ahead, uh, we're going to see much more displacement of communities, whether it's from strife, from war, or from any um, weather calamities or major storm events, we can actually look at creating new communities, perhaps in new areas given sea level rise, perhaps um, only temporarily as we rebuild cities and communities. But that essential connection between heritage communities and the land is something that's very important to understand for us now and in the future.